It is also useful for, for companies to be aware of common compliance issues that inspectors will look for. Let's consider elements of the quality risk management review that inspectors will undertake. GP inspectors will look at when a manufacturer applies the quality risk management approaches and principles in their own quality management systems. They wanted to determine how it's applied by looking at examples of deviations, customer complaints and change control. Inspectors will look at training records and how the manufacturer performs the training in the use of the relevant tools and processes. Incomplete identification, assessment and control of risk will need to be assessed. They'll want to verify that the manufacturer is able to identify, assess and apply controls to specific risks that have actually been experienced. Our inspectors will assess what risk mitigations the manufacturer has for a specific risk and whether mitigation strategies are appropriate or sufficient. They will look for inappropriate acceptance of risk by focusing on an issue, for example, to see what controls and mitigation, mitigations were implemented. Inspectors will assess whether the risk management tools that are used are applied consistently consistently as per NX20 of the PICS guide with manufacturing practice. And they will seek to determine if there's a lack of awareness of risk processes by questioning staff and reviewing sample risk assessments to see whether the manufacturer has considered all risks for an issue. The GMP inspectors will also assess whether the risk mitigations that the manufacturer has documented are effective or not. So issues should be assessed for effectiveness and documented. Finally, inspectors will look for complicated risk assessment processes that are incorrectly applied and not actioned. So with good preparation, manufacturers can readily demonstrate excellent compliance with current GMPs, quality risk assessment principles. 